Yo, what's been going on guys? I'm back with another video finally. It's been like over a month since my last video But anyways, I am finally back now, The reason why it took so long to make all these videos is because of course I had exams I'm in college now, so I have to spend a little bit more time to actually work for school um, So yeah, that's why it actually took so long for this video to come out Anyways, I am on Immortal, my own server again, obviously. Um, right now, there are only three people online. I know I have been neglecting the server for the last month, month and a half a bit, because of, of course, the um, school stuff that I had to do. However, the developer Johnny was doing a lot of back, uh, back end stuff to the server. There is a whole topic on the forums, as you can see right here, with all the updates that have been done over the past month and a half. So um, yeah, if you want to read through it, there is a link down below in the description, so you can definitely check it out. It's mainly back-end stuff, like fixing bugs and all that um, good stuff, also making the game a bit more smooth. Anyways, the home area has also been redone, so right now the home area is actually here in Edgeville. Um, there are some few other things that have been redone which I'll go over in a second starting off actually with the um, tab right here now I think this tab is really nice because you have the monster locks you can check out the amount of NPCs you have killed you have the commands right here that you can use um, the donate lock the drops lock where you can actually find an NPC or uh, the drops um, then you also have a gear uh, button right here, something that heals you, so you get back to max HP and prayer. Um, a bank if you are super donated or higher rank, and then help, which actually makes a ticket if you are not a staff member. Now besides that, there are only some small improvements in game actually. Uh, for example, to go to the teleport instance, uh, to go to the demonic champion in the lead zone, you can actually get an instance now for 750 mil. Um, also, if you go to the PVM teleports right here, um, for the blue jet, this is already done as well. However, we will be implementing the instances for basically every single boss here. Um, so yeah, that will be coming soon, as well as some really uh, cool other updates, Cerberus will be coming soon. Um, besides that, we will have a new zone with a bunch of customs, um, which were made by one of the moderators on the staff team, which is Mike. So a huge thanks to Mike once again. And um, yeah, he made a bunch of customs, so we will be working on adding those in one zone for a future update. So you, can, so you guys have another grinding zone where you can go to. Um, the money zone and clay and blink are still the main um, starting money making methods. Of course they all have the um, keys and chests you can still open. Um, but they also have a package which will still be renamed and will have another model. But what the package basically does is it, it's basically acting like a starter mystery box which will be the name. You will be able to get this and then you will be able to get some rare rewards or even some insanely rare rewards. You can get up to a ring of wealth from this so yeah that's pretty nice. Now besides all that great stuff, we are still working on other things to implement. For example, this well right here. This will become a well of goodwill where you will be donating some um, cash um, in return for double experience and a bonus drop rate for the whole server. So yeah, that will be pretty nice once that is done. That should be done with one of the next updates so later on in this month, which is pretty nice. Um, then we are also working on, if you can check the wo uh, wolf hunter here, um, we are working on wilderness hunter so if you go to here um, you actually need some items which I don't have uh, to catch these implings but there are some custom implings and of course I, I took some items that I'm not allowed to uh, so let me just bang them real quick um, but anyways there are some implings um, that you can catch which require over 99 slayer now for the people who don't know you can actually get up to 120 in each skill so um, yeah that's pretty nice as well um, right now I am 99 so I won't be able to catch some of these for example dark ninja uh, dark implings um, oh you need a nut and a um, jar but also for the banning implings it doesn't say what level you need because I don't have the jar and uh, stuff but I think the Bane requires 112 or something and um, then the flame requires 117 I don't know exactly but from these implants you will be getting some nice rewards, so it's definitely worth training up over 99 for your hunter. Um, also, for all the other skills, I will be working on some other money-making methods once you pass level 99. So there is actually a purpose of going for that 120 skills. 
Now besides that, I just once again want to apologize real quick uh, for the inactivity on my YouTube channel as well as for the inactivity on updates for Immortal. However, now that my exams are over, I will be getting into more of content creating myself together with the developer Johnny who is still teaching me a lot of new things so I can improve the game as well as he will. Um, so yeah, that will be really great, so some really nice future sites. Um, Besides that, also for my exams, I kind of failed, so I will have to do them again in August, so yeah, um, blame me. But um, yeah, anyways, I hope you guys did enjoy this small little update video. Just keep in mind that there will be more videos coming soon, and um, there will be more updates coming soon to Immortal as well. So definitely make sure you come in-game and check out the features we have, so you can already build up for once we update. Anyways, that will be it for this video guys, I hope you guys did enjoy, if you did make sure to smash the like button and subscribe if you didn't already and I'll catch you guys in my next video, peace.